Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Meta. The report was first published on our website Friday, September 30, 2022, but this is a more detailed version. Our aim is to help you answer the question, should I buy or sell Meta? In this video, you will get insight into the technical and fundamental situation and future price predictions. Please remember to subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Since September 12, 2022, our system ranks the Meta stock as a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 5.157. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 19.70%. This is an average return of minus 1.31% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Meta our last headline reads, Evaluation of Meta stock downgraded after the last trading session. The Meta stock price fell by minus 0.54% on the last day, Friday, September 30, 2022, from $136.41 to $135.68. It has now fallen three days in a row. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 4.04% from a day low at $135.51 to a day high of $140.99. The price has fallen in 8 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 7.25% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day by 231,000 shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 634,000 shares were bought and sold for approximately $86.05 million. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $353.83, and the lowest price was $134.14. Right now the price is 61.65%, or $218.15, below 52-week high and 64.7%, or $248.65, below all-time high September 1, 2021 where the price hit $384.33. The stock lies in the lower of a very wide and falling trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at $133.10 is broken, it will firstly indicate a stronger fall rate. The current 3-month trend indicates a possible minus 14.03% change over the next 3 months, with a possible return between minus 15.66% and 5.59%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 56.76% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 65% and minus 44.81%. This equals a price between $47.48 and $74.88 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets From analysts Meta stock received a general buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Meta stock a neutral rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for Meta. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Tuesday, September 27, 2022, and so far it has risen 0.95%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Meta stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $138.24 and $157.34. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning and the stock should be followed more closely. 
Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a sell signal. Pivots gave a buy signal 4 days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal 9 days ago. The short-term moving average for the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 4 days ago. The long-term moving average for the 3-month chart gave a sell signal 15 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 27 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see short moving average gave a sell signal 15 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a sell signal 192 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages holds a sell signal. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Meta Meta finds support from accumulated volume at $134.40 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock may move much during the day, volatility, and with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $5.48 between high and low, or 4.04%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 4.33%. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Meta. The Price to Earnings Ratio (PE ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Meta currently has a price earning ratio of 11.28. This is an relatively low price-to-earnings ratio and either signal a low expectation for the future of the company, or that the stock is undervalued and could indicate a buying opportunity. Next upcoming earnings report for Q3 2022 is expected to be released October 24, 2022. The consensus among the analysts are $1.94. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Meta meets first resistance at $151.47. If you do not hold Meta shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Meta finds first level of support at $134.40 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. In the table we have listed other potential swing trading levels based on the, the famous Fibonacci model. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Meta is buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. The five latest insides trades have been done by Neusta Jennifer whom have bought and sold 1,710 shares or options in the company. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 42.415. In total, the insiders bought 127,760 and sold 317,615 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is Meta stock a buy? Meta holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this stock. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a strong sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Monday 3rd we expect Meta to open up $1.71 and start trading at $137.39. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. And remember to subscribe to the channel to get all the latest videos and updates.